Science and technology have been making disruptive progress in the last two decades. Humanity has advanced into space and material sciences have developed by leaps and bounds. Well, now a bunch of scientists from our own Indian Institute of Science have developed a drone that can be controlled by thought and not by joysticks. Well, this may sound like science fiction, but here's an interesting reality check. The 21st century is witnessing the enormous technological advancement in human history. There is unprecedented convergence between man and machine, something only visualized by science fiction. In recent times, we have seen technology being integrated in neuroscience. Those trends are evident right here in Nama Bengaluru. At the IT city's pride, the Indian Institute of Science, a bunch of young students, Mentored by the teachers are attempting to integrate avionics with neuroscience. The Department of Aviation at IASE is not new to innovation. In the past, they have successfully come up with innovative ideas. But this time, they came up with something very unique. This drone is controlled by brain waves. A drone that can be maneuvered by thought. This is the first brain controlled drone developed in India. The man behind this achievement is SN Omkar. He is no stranger to the mysteries of the human mind. Being a yoga teacher, the chief research scientist of the Department of Aerospace Engineering and IISC seeks to unravel mysteries of mind. Think about flying? Well, your wish is granted. Recently, the department has added one more golden feather to its hat. The brain-controlled drone imparts the creator's aura to Dr. Omkar, who makes actions possible with just a flash of thought in his mind. Dr. Omkar and his team of students took us to the backyard of their department and demonstrated how a drone can be flown by just thinking about it. Flying the drone with mind. Sitting on a chair, Dr. Omkar placed a small drone in front of him. Then he fitted a neurosensitive device which looks more like a headphone onto his head. It is known as electroencephalogram. Well, this is what followed. Sitting in a yogic position, he instructed the drone slowly to move up, down, left and right. After a small demonstration of their newly invented device, Professor Omkar talked about the technology that drives the device. How does the device work? Pressing buttons and fiddling with a joystick to fly a toy plane is commonplace. But to these young scientists, joysticks are obsolete technology. Brain control devices have been around for many decades, but so far the concept was not used in practical applications. The development of EEG technology can be traced back to 1920s, but recent research and exploration in this field has led brain computer interfacing. This is a system that allows the brain to communicate directly with an external device. It will allow people to control the machine simply by thinking about specific movements. The specially designed interface will pick up signals from brain which refer to specific commands such as up, down, right or left. The neurons in the brain motor produce tiny electric signals that are captured by the special sensor device. The captured signals are sent to a computer where they are decoded and are fed into the quadcopter through a Wi-Fi system. The drone operates based on the thought of its operator who wears electroencephalogram headset. 
Initially, drones were associated with militaries, but now drones have evolved quickly into tools for almost all applications. They have become flying extensions of the human desire to innovate, to make life easier and more enjoyable. Drones are already being used in rescue operations, checking poaching in Africa, and even thought of as delivery vehicles. Applications of the Mind Control Drone This drone can primarily be used for military operations as the operator can guide the drone into the enemy territory and carry out surveillance. The team believes that once the technology reaches maturity, it can be used for a wide range of applications. The EEG headsets can be of great help to the visually impaired. Using this technology, visually impaired people can do any tasks. Students in the department have worked day and night to make the mind control drone a reality. The experience of making in India The University of Florida conducted the world's first mind control drone in 2016, which opened the possibility of developing the mind control robots. Within a year, the IISE 2 has achieved this feat. However, what is notable is that students in IISE did it with less resources and far lower fundings. These young minds created a future technology in their first attempt. With the Make in India initiative of Prime Minister Narendra Modi in place, it is believed that India will soon be a technology powerhouse. These young minds are filled with new and innovative ideas. The young creators can make wonders with the right kind of support from initiatives like Make in India. A Newsline Report